Hallelujah. Let me make the altar call. Next time you go to visit somebody and he says, what did you bring for me? Tell them I brought a name. You mean you didn't bring even a bag of water? Now I'm saying, respect elders and carry all these things. But with it, add a name. And tell them in the name of Jesus, I speak blessings upon this family. And walk away. By next week, they will call you back and say, please speak again. Whatever you said last week started changing things. Are we together now? You are here and you've not given your heart to Jesus Christ. The name will not work for you. The name of the Lord is only for believers who are in Christ. And perhaps while you heard me teach, the Lord began to speak to you to say, make it right with Jesus. Our time is fast spent. Power, genuine power resides only with an encounter with Jesus. The power that comes with laws and principles like you have learned is limited. I'm about to count one to five. I know that our time is fast spent, but for the sake of one person who wants to make it right with Jesus, I do not want this service to end without giving you that opportunity. Wherever you are, I want you to leave your seat very boldly and come and stand in front here. I begin my counting now. One, come. Come. God bless you. God bless you. These are not the only ones. Come, gentlemen. Make it right with Jesus. Koinonia, is this the best you can do for them? Celebrate men and women who are about to have access to the name. The name that is above every other name. Above every other name. Above sicknesses and diseases. Hallelujah. If you are joining them, please come quickly. I want to lead them to pray right now. You're joining them, please come quickly. If you don't pray the prayer, you're not saved. Remember, God bless you. Hallelujah. Now, say this after me. Lift your right hand. Let me request, please. Lift your right hand. God bless you. Thank you for the boldness to come. It's never too late to make it right with Jesus. Say this after me. Say it loud and clear. Say, Lord Jesus, tonight I have heard your word. I come to you just as I am. I believe that you died for me. I believe that you rose again for my justification. Right now, I receive Jesus into my heart as my Savior, as my Lord, and as my King. I declare that the power of sin, Satan, hell, and the grave is broken over me. From tonight and forever, I am a child of God, saved by the blood of the Lamb. Amen. Keep your hands lifted. Father, thank you for these ones. The Bible declares that as many who will come to him, you will no wise despise and cast away. I decree and declare by the authority of Scripture that your sins are forgiven. And tonight begins a new season in your life. You go from glory to glory and grace to grace. In Jesus' matchless name we pray. Amen and amen. Please let me request that you move to my right, which will be your left. You have a word very quickly with the counselors, and then you'll be back to your seat. Let's give them a big, big hand clap. Hallelujah. Are you celebrating them? In the name of Jesus, I speak over your life that this name you have, you have found as an inheritance, let it work wonders this week. In the name of Jesus Christ. And like we have learned, anybody who tries to use elemental forces against you, they will see the superior power of Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ. By this prayer, every fear that you have fear of men using things against you, in the name of Jesus, I prophesy to you, it will not work. And where it has been working before now, that power is broken officially. In the name of Jesus Christ. Therefore, in the name of Jesus, go and prosper. In the name of Jesus, experience favor. In the name of Jesus, rise to the next level. In the name of Jesus, experience restoration. In the name of Jesus, I call you victorious. You are blessed in the city. You are blessed in the country. In the name of Jesus Christ, elemental forces only work to your advantage. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. 
After we share the grace, I'd like you to hug and greet someone and tell him you are blessed in the name of Jesus. Let's share the grace. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit, rest and abide with us now and forevermore. Surely, God's goodness and mercies follow us all the days of our lives as we dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. God bless you. See you next week.